Hey everyone, it's Dave here and welcome to Warhammer Tempest Fall Overview. About a few weeks ago I saw a teaser of this game on Reddit and some mention that it's gonna eventually come to Quest. So I was like, why not try it now? I mean, since Warhammer Battle Sister was like an average experience, maybe the creators of the Wizards will deliver a proper Warhammer game for us. So Tempest Fall is an action-adventure fantasy game where you clash with forces of Nighthound and deliver destruction in the name of Sigmar. I don't particularly know what's going on in this universe, if it's even canon or not to the original storyline, but what interests me particularly in this game is that it's a more adventure combat take on that series rather than just a common FPS shooter. The trailer presented some kind of until you fall mechanics with pairing the hits from the enemies which I'm all down for because until you fall for me to this day has the best combat mechanics in all of sword fighting games. It's so good implementation of that mechanics that I feel like every melee game should be implementing that system. I suppose this overview will be mostly to see how the game plays out and if it's something to look forward when it will eventually arrive on the quest store. I would be surprised if I would turn it into playthrough knowing my current busy schedule but who knows this game should be up my alley and let's fight some skellies. It says free movement but I have a snap turn so I hope I'm gonna be able to change that later. Ah here we go. <laughs> it's a little bit fast, what the hell? A full on Disneyland. <laughs> Wait, but now I changed the rotation speed in the menu because before it was like an introduction UI and now it's fine? Like what's this inconsistency? <laughs> I'm not touching it further though, let's just start. <laughs> Hello. What warrior returns to the anvil of apotheosis? Welcome back, Lord Arcanum Caster Storm's Cryer. You were dealt a grievous blow. Your very soul is diminished. Yet your service continues. Your tale is not over. A new task of grave importance awaits you in Shirish. The Stormcast Eternals posted in Dreadheim fall. Yet their souls do not return to Essia. The Necroquake has upset the order of the mortal realms. Reunite with your fellow Hammers of Sigma. Seek the lost souls of the Anvils of the Helden Hammer. Bring order and deliver justice. In the name of Sigma! <laughs> All the new words are just like flying through my head because I don't know Warhammer that well. Hard grip to use your weapon. This to switch apparently. Interesting. Hey. <laughs> More undead come at me. Oh, two weapons at the same time. What are you doing? With enough force to power their attack. Oh, okay. Grab the free skeleton by the torso of the head, then rip them apart. <laughs> Skip the spirit to No, no, no. While holding trigger, swing your upper horizontally to the left and right to cast a spell. A horizontal swipe, but can I do it with a sword? Because I don't think so. So maybe with this. Okay, so that's like a staff. Oh, it's another one, alright. Looks so similar. Made it. Okay. Whoa! The environment looks sick. Is this unlimited? Oh. That's kinda easy then. Perform a fast motion with your hand while holding trigger to cast arcane bolt. I wish we would have some mana or something like that because that's just like easy mode. Be gone, vermin. Back to resting in peace. <laughs> the 
it's basically like a blade of sensory. You really don't want me to leave this place, do you? But the environment looks so fun. Night haunt. Come at me, Wraith. Test Sigmar's chosen. What's happening there? What wicked force could disrupt the landing of Sigmar's Tempest? My brotherhood will be in the city proper. I best be on my way. Hmm. The Necroquake seems to be waking even remains of ancient beasts. Huh. Cap collectibles by person grip, oh, obviously. <laughs> Do we have something here? No. Where is this dude fighting? Liberator, why does your essence not return to Wazir? Must find the others and quickly. Hmm. This should get me across if I hold on to it. That's kind of obvious. Oh, damn it. <laughs> Aye. <laughs> Maybe I'll cast it mid air or something. Restless undead, aren't you? Let me grant you that rest. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> can't catch me. <laughs> okay. What is this? A displaced soul? This is someone's memory. Cruel death in a cruel time. May you find peace. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm not playing like that. I see you. <laughs> this is definitely way too easy, like... The gameplay can be, you know, fun and stuff, but if there's no challenge... Then what's the point of playing? <laughs> this 
wall will crumble any moment. It might need weaponized encouragement, though. Wait, what? Strength. <laughs> okay. I definitely need like a health bar, a mana bar. Just stuff that keeps me on my toes, because I can't do just reckless stuff with no issues. Maybe like a cooldown on the spells, that would be some kind of balance. Oh my god. Obviously. It's like the world is big, but it's almost empty. <laughs> well, I've seen the trailer. <laughs> I don't feel like the sword even connects. It just flings, but it's not like extremely responsive. I'm struggling. <laughs> It's even the swinging, like... When I do a full swing, it like either stops in the middle or like goes under? Something's going on. Foul magic and strange night hunt. My comrade. I was too late. By Sigma. Even if I have to walk this wretched realm alone, I will free all of you. I can cross into the city through the wreckage. The only way is forward.
sea breeze. I'm near the port. There should be a temple to Sigmar nearby. Whoa. I know I repeat myself and I'm not familiar with Warhammer, but how you have the war design and stuff like that, it's crazy. Let me test out the mechanics More now. Undead. Come at me. Yeah, it stops. See? If you do fast swing, it doesn't even connect. You have to do like a very slow movement. Yeah. Because the fast one? Uh uh. Not it. I don't even know why. Maybe I'm like, I don't know, too fast or something? Yeah, what's going on? Lord Arcanum Storm's cry, yes? Welcome to Dreadheim, my lord. By Azir, am I glad to see you. Was it you causing the blast out there? Is anyone? They have fallen to the very magic we were sent to put an end to. I have never witnessed a spell so revolting. Our comrades' souls were taken. And I was too late to stop the wizard responsible. That's... I have no words. I'm only glad you were unharmed, my lord. A few of us stayed behind to secure the camp. It's in the temple right up the stairs. Have a look around for any supplies left in the wake of the attack. And join us there, please. Be wary of any stray and dead skulking around. <laughs> Gucci, like look at this. You can't just basically walk around here and just bask in the landscapes. <laughs> well, I guess I'm kind of 50-50 on this game. As much as the world design and the whole ambience is amazing, the actual combat feels clunky. If you do like fast movements, nothing really connects. Maybe it's my ADHD or something like that, but in every game I've played, no matter the speed, everything would work no matter what. Here you have to do slow movements, just take your time, and then it's fine. But there's no difficulty, like you can just ignore the whole power and blocking and just spam casting the spells like you want to because there's no cooldown no mana no nothing to really subdue that so like overall it's fun to explore but the whole mechanics feel like an afterthought and should be more polished when it's gonna arrive on the quest i guess that's my take on it for now i suppose see you on the standalone